Hey everyone, it's Victor. Uh, and today I think I wanted to start with lesson one of what it means to be unbrokeable. And I think the first lesson always, always, always should be start young. So what do I mean by that? Where I'm going right now, it's my son's bedroom. And as you can see, he probably has every toy imaginable in here. But what are those bags in that box? What we decided to do today was tell my son that for every toy he puts in those bags or box, he will be able to get a certain amount of money. By the time he was done, we gave him $10 to use however he wanted to. What did he decide to do? He said, Daddy, let's go to Walmart or the flea market and buy some Shopkins toys. I was like, okay, less space in the room taken up, but now you can go get a new toy because you decided to make your own money for the day. Sure, it came from us, but he had to give something up. What I'm going to do later with that is probably itemize it, catalog it, and then put it on Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, or Instagram. And maybe he can make even more money by giving up the toys that he did. But I think it's a very important lesson because at his age, he's four, I, one, did not have this many toys, nor did we have the financial stability in my home to get extra toys. But no one ever taught me how to really spend a buck. They told me money came in, cash went out, you get what you want, you don't save, but you don't earn which turned into me just getting a nine to five job, going in, checking in, checking out, getting my check at the end of every two weeks, and then spending on the normal bills. In the last couple of years, I decided that if I'm gonna be an entrepreneur and want my son to break that cycle, then I'm gonna to have to teach him early. And that's what we did. We decided if he is gonna be financially liberated in the future, if he's gonna be his own boss, if he's gonna make his own money, he's gonna to have to learn rule number one, and that's start young. If anyone knows, financial literacy is probably one of the most important things you can ever learn. Uh, they don't teach it to you in school. They don't teach it to you in college. They barely teach it to you in the office. You always have to have someone who can teach you that. Similar to that rich dad, poor dad theory. Everyone's seen the book. They make you read it, but they can't even really apply it to your life if you come from a low-income neighborhood. Similar to me. Um, I don't think I ever saw my mom work. I don't think I ever saw my mom do anything other than collect a welfare check or food stamps or anything of that nature, borrow money from people to then give to others. So I really wanted to instill that concept in him and that's my plan. So yeah, that's what we did. We went, we took all his toys. He had some Paw Patrol, he had some PJ Masks, some things that he didn't play with anymore and decided that he throw it in those bags. He got 10 bucks, we went to the flea market um, and I'll show you the footage of that. I saw some really nice collectibles, some great Pokemon cards, a few pops scattered throughout the place. But I really wanted to go out and talk about the concept of being unbrokeable, not having a vision or a mission that could be deterred and not changing your values, but really finding a way to make sure that you yourself and your family could find the best possible ways to reach financial freedom the way I've been trying to. Uh, I'm not an advisor. This is not financial advice. Um, it's just someone trying to share their vision of their goals and their future, um, but also something that I want to do for my son. I think it's really important to teach him. Uh, again, look at this room. He has more than what he needs. He has towers. He has all the books. His, the, the shelf is broken, I think, on that book. He has his own little standalone arcade machine. He has a couch with every Care Bear on it, Lego set, all of this stuff, um, but he doesn't really know where it comes from. So yeah, rule number one of being unbreakable. Well, unbreakable, sorry, unbrokeable. Teach your kids young because if they learn how to be financially independent, spend their money right, then they'll be able to make right decisions when they get older and they don't have to labor nine to five like most people do. Uh, so yeah, here's going to be some footage of the flea market and I really appreciate y'all listening to my rant. Talk soon. Bye.
Yeah, so I really hope y'all enjoyed that flea market footage. It is a flea market out in Southbridge, Massachusetts, right on Route 20. Um, and as always, I always forget, like, subscribe, share, comment, good, bad, whatever it is. I really want to hear from you all. All right, have a good one. Bye.